Hi everyone! So I'm behind the camera today. We're also in my hallway in case the sound is like echoey or sounds different than my normal videos. But I'm finally inspired to do my loaf collection video. Um, I mentioned that I could do more of like a loaf collection when I showed my whole wax melt collection and organization, but I didn't go into depth in my loaves because I feel like that would have just made the video twice as long. Um, so I'm ready to dive in. I put my camera on like the zoomed out setting so it looks, you can see all the bags basically instead of being like too up close. So my plan is that I think I'm gonna empty out all these bags. I will probably be surprised as I empty out all these bags because I have not looked in them. Um, they've been in bags even in our in my apartment. So I'm very curious to see everything that I have that's been hiding in my closet. I'm going to reorganize, um, I think, store store by vendor, which it kind of is, kind of isn't. Um, I want to put out loaves to the side that I want to give away to my friend. And then I also want to put aside loaves that I want to chop. And then we'll put away the rest. Back in the bags, I have a Target bag, three reusable, um, like reusable grocery bags, a purse that randomly has some Sassy Girl Aroma loaves, and then a um, little, I think it's like a medium sized box over there that I would like to just condense down my loaf collection into just the three reusable tote bags. So let's just start emptying out. And I think I'm going to put the bags to the side and then group by vendor. So hopefully the camera Hopefully this is an all right angle. Maybe I'll point it down just so we can put the loaves um, on the floor here. I think because I see a lot of Sassy Girl Aroma loaves, let me, let me put out my Sassy Girl Aroma loaves here, which to be completely honest, I didn't even realize I had this many Sassy Girl Aroma loaves. I do keep like a wax melt spreadsheet, but you know, out of sight, out of mind. Like, I I didn't realize I had so many. Um, the only thing I really double bag in my collection is loaves. And I also try to write, like, the date that I received it. Just, like, the month and year. Just so I can kind of keep track. I try to do that on most things. So, maybe really quick I'll show the loaves. But I won't go into depth, like, into the scent notes. Pistachio zucchini waffle cone, um, pink sugar cookies, pistachio cookies. Did I really need two pistachio loaves? Probably not. Um, Chinese almond cookies, Garcia, and royal cookies. I also probably, looking back, I could see why I got this because I like to use um, loaves as like blender items, but uh, I probably didn't need just a royal cookies, but um, maybe when I chop that up, I'll give like half of the loaf to my friend. We have Rise of Fall. That's a really good one. I'll Get By With Bread. That's also an amazing blend. Cupcakes at Tiffany's. There was a while back where she said that she wasn't going to offer cupcakes at Tiffany's anymore, but she must have found the oil again or something. My first, my, what is this? Oh, Me Love Fruit Loops. I thought it was one of the, like, my first love blends. This is from last May. I don't have a lot of Fruit Loops blends right now. I might chop this one. Okay, let me just, let's put all the vendors together and then I'll decide as we're putting away what ones I want to chop. 
Florida Citrus Birthday. That would also be a really nice one for the spring summertime. Oh, okay. Five Little Pumpkins. Love those colors. Oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. That's definitely going to fall again. My First Love. This was one of the first blends that I purchased um, from Sassy Girl Aroma. Oh my god, I can't believe I have so many. <laughs> Sun-dried cotton. Do you have any more? Okay, that might be all my Sassy Girl Aroma loaves, but we will see as we unload the bags. I have... I believe this is my only Salt Mountain Melts loaf, milk and cookies for Santa. All right, let me put this bag. Oh, never mind. Here is 100% That Witch. And I thought there was a couple more then that I just remembered. Oh, yes. Hungry Ghost. That might be all of them now. Oh, okay, one more. This I swear this one's the last one because I don't have a lot of salt mountain melts. This is Haunted Bake Shop. All right. Now, is this good or? Yeah, I like the far away view, I think. Um, let's go on. Again, hopefully the sound is okay because I'm like switching sides of my camera and I'm behind the camera and sometimes I'm more up front. So hopefully it's all right. Um, some southbound, not a lot, but a couple. Blueberry pie crust, marshmallow bread. And strawberry icing on the cake. Red, white, and blue. That might be all my southbound i didn't have too many of them the majority is going to be l3 for sure well i guess we'll see um i have just one do i have more well right now on the top i see one vintage chic sense in collectible lunchbox let's just put that on top of the salt mountain melts I have quite a bit of swanky. So we have Little Witch's Fireside Cream Cake. Coconut Marshmallow Dream Cake. Some of these swanky ones I'm going to put to the side and definitely want to chop up. Snow Angels. Her loaves are really pretty. Pumpkin Donut Shop. Blueberry Pumpkin Pecan Waffle Cone Noel. Pink Frosted Cream Cake. And then we have Strawberry Royale. Uh, Strawberry Pound Cake Vanilla Dream Cake. Sorry, some of the labels are hard to read because I have to smush down the bag when I double bag. Strawberry pound cake, cupcakes at Tiffany's, raspberry jam, butter, butter cookies, vanilla sugar waffle cone. That one's going to be an amazing blend. Lavender sugar cookie vanilla cotton candy. Sorry, I'm like reading the label through my phone screen. Um, raspberry jam queen of cupcakes sugar cookies. I know I'm going to like that one too. She has a really good raspberry jam. It's definitely like bakery fruity, not floral or like perfumey. My Darling Vanilla. She recently just had a pre-order. Um, I think it was in early March, maybe. Any more swanky? 
Okay, I think that's all my swanky. Again, we may come across more. Oh, okay. This one was actually kind of hiding. Strawberry pound, no. Strawberry bread, pumpkin pecan waffles, strawberry pound cake, glazed donuts. Okay, I think that's all the swanky now. Let's do... Um... Let's do my farm, no, let's do my um, bathing garden large clams. I have them stored with my loaves just because it is, you know, a large wax size item. So let's go through. I know a lot of you guys were like, oh my gosh, I thought your bathing garden collection would be a lot bigger. And to be honest, I did. Um, I mean, I melted through a lot, but I also gave away a lot to my friend because there were just so much like... If you watch any of my haul videos, I had so much bathing garden and there was just so many scents that like on cold. I know it's not entirely fair to judge on cold, but they just weren't like love. So I was like, let me rehome them if I don't love them because there are so many other scents I do love that I want to warm first. So anyway, good night, Alice. Um, the bathing garden wax is so pretty the cloud maze circus bread i have multiple of these um one two oh two of them and then strawberry nonsense parisian strawberry fields marzipan princess cake lemon cheesecake i've just set some of these out to melt Pucker, Acts of Kindness, and then Great Grape Waffle Cone. So we emptied one bag. I got these bags from the ABC store in Hawaii when we were there last year. Now I want to do my pharmacist daughter. Oh, look at what I found. Two more swanky loaves. Falling in Love. I should chop this one because this one I got last April in like a flash sale, ready, ready to ship sale. So I should chop this one because that one's a little bit old. And then fall celebration. I knew we would find some more. Okay. I have a lot of pharmacist daughter too. So let's go through some of those ice cream in august this was a custom i put this little i don't know if you can tell it's a little sticker that says emily on it um so i remembered they were customs that i had done um i guess i didn't write the date on this but i'd assume it's a year if not older berry cone again oh wait that says berry cute sorry it's hard to read because the bag some of the loaf bags are the exact same size as the bag that I double bagged it with so you kind of have to smush it in there um fancy nancy strawberry zucchini bread mochi that was one that I created sorry you can like barely read that of course, we all also have to make a mini. Happy birthday. Dreaming of dessert. Was that a custom? Mm, I don't know. For some reason, I thought it was, but I have a different custom I might have made. We have coffee cake. Coffee for Bran. I made us a couple coffee cost coffee customs. So then there's mine. Coffee for Emily. Say it back. They do have some really great coffee blends. I find coffee blends, um, they're amazing while they're going, but I don't find any to be like super long lasting, like from any vendor. Sweet Mountain Java. This one is King Cake. I know that one's hard to read. 
Oh my goodness, it's crazy seeing everything laid out in front of me. How many loaves were hiding? You're my lobster. Dear Santa. Bake my day. Wow, I have a lot of like coffee blends from them. Okay, um, that is all my pharmacist daughter, I think. Again, we may stumble across some more eventually. Um, I believe the rest are L3. So let me move the camera. Sorry, I'm moving too. Um, let's move it down a little bit so we can have the L3 ones in frame. I know that I'm going to have a couple duplicates in my L3 collection because L3 will run like amazing sales every once in a while. So I'll pick up loaves. I'll pick up duplicates because I think I'm going to love them. But oh my gosh, it takes a long time to get through loaves. So I'm definitely not trying to order like duplicates, backups of anything like I'm definitely someone where once I find something I love, I feel like I need to get so many backups, but realistically, like, I'd rather warm through something I love and then just look out to purchase it again in the future because, you know, you don't want tons of backups and then they get, like, old or they lose scent, so I'm trying to be better about that. Um, okay, so let's start going through. Anything I have backups of, I'm going to set aside and put it on like my chopping, um, put it in my chopping pile. So we have caramel apple, mac apple, green apple. This is a little bit of a newer one. I mean, it was from September last year. We have cake topper, Cali comfort. Fat Bottom Girls, Santa's on Keto. Fat Bottom Girls, So Fetch. That one, I mean, they have an overlapping note, I guess. Pink Frosted Cake. Today is October 3rd. Fruit Loops, Zucchini Bread, White Elephant Exchange, Sugar Milk. I actually created a blend in their customer creation blend that were these notes. I called it like morning madness. It didn't end up winning the customer blend creation, but they did pour it in puppy packs a while back. And every once in a while, I'll see this blend pour it again. So I, I picked it up when I saw it in a loaf. Should I move these closer? Move this down a little bit. Okay. Santa's on keto times two. So let me, because I know there's going to be some duplicates, let me put my duplicate pile right here so I know to just keep that to the side and chop up these ones. Lavender, sugar cookie dough, sugared shortbread, Hufflepuff. I love this scent. I've had multiples of this in the past. I think this is my last one now. I don't know. We'll see, but I do love this one. Diet starts Monday. I'm pretty sure I have two of these. Hmm. I don't see it, so I'm going to put it over here for now. I try if I get duplicates to put them by each other in the bag, so... Yeah, I don't know. I don't see it. Two sugar cookie royales. They have the best sugar cookie royale blend. It's so strong. It you you know, it doesn't smell like anything special on cold, but it is so good on warm. I'm going to put that there and then I'll put one in my chop pile. Hi Minnie. Hi Minnie. Want to say hi Minnie? There's Minnie. Oh, hello. <laughs> hi Minnie. I just gave her a haircut actually. Hi, Minnie. You want to sit by me? Cupcakes at Tiffany's Zucchini Red. I'm pretty sure I have two of these. I don't know. Sometimes I get 
multiples of these like you know quote staple scents and do i really need to do that probably not um sugar cookie royale zucchini bread another one of those staple blends so i got two at one point and that one's gonna fall over um oh oh my gosh i'm sorry Minnie. i dropped a loaf on her side okay pumpkin pecan waffle sugar cookie royale zucchini bread another staple it's so good i have two of them so i'm gonna set one to the side all right Minnie, can i move you i don't want to drop any more wax on you oh sorry Minnie. here why don't you sit over here i sit there on the other side oh okay you're circling back okay um Strawberry sugar, fresh picked strawberries, sugar cookie royale. Summer scoop, strawberry pound cake, don't cross streams. Sometimes the loaves, and I keep them in a closet with no windows. Um, and it's mainly dark, like we don't leave the lights on or anything. And wax will just kind of start discoloring a little bit. Um, strawberry pound cake, summer scoop, sugar cookie dough waffle cone. I have a lot of strawberry bakery blends, so I might pull aside a couple to just chop up. Strawberry jam, cream cheese, frosting, sugared shortbread. Oh, whoa. Okay, oh well. Pink frosted cake, strawberry sugar, pink frosted animal cookies. All right, that's another bag emptied, but we still have more. Aunt's Jam Phil Jelly Rolls, they have an amazing strawberry jam blend. Wildberry Mousse Zucchini Bread Sugar Cookie Royale. Oh no, okay. Snooze Button, that's an amazing lavender bakery. Cotton Candy Craze, Strawberry Sugar Fluffy Towels. This is a really sweet, lovely, like clean but sweet blend. Pink Chiffon Warm Vanilla Sugar Palo Santo. Sugar Cookie Dough Pumpkin Pecan Waffles. Here's another Diet Starts Monday. So we have one of these, right? Mm -mm. Yep, it's right there. So I'm going to put this in the chop pile. Pumpkin pecan waffles, strawberry pound cake, sugar cookie royale. Wildberry mousse cupcakes at Tiffany's. This is crazy how many loaves I have. Pumpkin pecan waffles, strawberry pound cake, sugar cookie royale. That's a dupe. So put that in this pile. My chop pile is getting too big now. Okay, another bag emptied. One more to go through. Lemon curd snuggle downy April fresh. This one sounds like a good one to chop now, like a fresh lemon laundry blend for the spring summer. So I think I'm just going to put that in my chop pile. Strawberry sugar sugar cookie royale. Strawberry jam zucchini bread peanut butter. And then I just have a plain strawberry jam as well. After we go through the whole loaves, I'm going to also separate like what I'm going to like declutter slash give away. And then, yeah, I'll just show how I reorganize the bags after. Okay, one more swanky here. Wait, nope. Sorry, this is Candles by Victoria. It looked like swanky at first. This was a custom I did, mini sweet treat. And then here's my other candles by Victoria Loaf I did in pumpkin mochi donut is what I called it. I'm just putting them over there for now. Okay. Oh. One more wildberry, sorry, one more southbound in wildberry cheesecake bread. Went and put that in the southbound pile. St 
strawberry jam zucchini bread. I definitely don't need this many strawberry jam scents. Oh, okay, so I found one more Hufflepuff. So I'm gonna double check the Hufflepuff loaf that's somewhere in that pile and see when I got that one. This one's from 1221, so I'm assuming that this one is the older one. Um, so I'm just gonna put this one in the chop pile, but I'll double check just to make sure because whichever one I chop, I do wanna make sure it's the older one. Most of them I bought at the same time, but I'm pretty sure um, I'm pretty sure the Hufflepuffs I bought at different times. Sugared corn pudding vanilla. Cupcakes at Tiffany's. See, do I need a L3 and a Sassy Roll Aroma? Because I'm pretty sure I have um, one from both vendor. Cupcakes at Tiffany's zucchini bread. I also feel like we already went over this one. Uh, I'll have to look. I'll have to look if I already have this. Um, this just sounds so familiar. I feel like we went through it. I'm going to just put it there. Um, sugar Cookie Royale Zucchini Bread Malo Fireside Sugar Milk. Sugar milk can sometimes be weird on cold, but it's usually really pretty when you warm it. Fresh Picked Strawberries Sugar Cookie Royale Fluff. Fresh Picked Strawberry White Elephant Exchange. Oh my goodness. The pile fell again. And Strawberry Pound Cake Sugar Cookie Dough Vanilla Ice Cream. That is my loaf collection. That is this bag empty as well. So it's quite large. There's Minnie. So there's the L3, some candles by Victoria, um, Swanky, Sassy Girl Aroma, Bathing Garden, The Pharmacist's Daughter, One Vintage Chic Scents, Salt Mountain Melts, and Southbound. So let's now organize into piles like what I want to giveaway to friends so let me pause do a little organizing look over everything and i will be right back all right so i'm back i looked over all my loaves did a little organizing decided everything that i want to set out to chop and made a little pile of loaves for my friend and there's Minnie listening to me <laughs> and made a little pile of loaves for my friend to gift to her because I got her hooked on wax. Hi Eugenia if you're watching. I got her hooked on wax to the till to this day she still has yet to buy wax herself. Well I think I think she's bought wax from like Target or Walmart. But vendor wax. I just every time she visits I send her with like bags of wax. <laughs> so I got her hooked on some wax. But um oh Minnie's so cute. Mochi's just hiding she likes to sleep in the basement. But anyway, this is still all the wax I'm keeping. So it's still a bit, but at least I kind of know where everything is, what I have. Um, so yeah, let's just go through it really quick. This is everything I'm keeping. Strawberry jam blends, strawberry blends, bakery blends of L3. I think more bakery blends. Um... And then kind of other fruity bakery, lavender, mint. The two candles by Victoria. I'm not going to chop those yet. And then my one VCS loaf. These are my um, swanky loaves stacked up right there. My bathing garden, large clams, and my sassy girl aroma. So everything I'm showing you right now, I'm going to put back in the three bags. Hopefully it all fits. Pharmacist daughter. Um, salt mountain melts and southbound so that's everything i'm keeping this is my to be chopped pile so i don't know when i'm gonna chop it but i'm gonna put these in my actual um room and grab these to chop on occasion i'm not gonna put them away in the um in the reusable tote bag so this is what i want to chop soon and then this is what i'm giving away to my friend a couple um i guess i'll show you guys which ones i'm giving away just a couple 
bathing garden clams. I think I've actually melted all of these, I believe, in the small clams. So I thought I'd give her these ones. A couple of L3, a lot were duplicates that I already had. And some are because I just have so much strawberry bakery that I just need to part with some. So this one, this one. So that's strawberry cupcakes at Tiffany's loaf. I have two of these. I have a loaf very similar to this one. So I thought I'd gift her one. I've had this loaf before. This is actually my second one. So I'm going to give her that and a strawberry jam because I have so many strawberry jam blends as well. And then a few pharmacist daughter because I had so many coffee, bakery, and strawberry blends. I'm just going to give her a couple of these as well. So yeah, so that is everything. I'm going to put everything in the reusable totes. I hope everything fits. Uh, let's see. All right, I think we were pretty successful. I was able to fit almost everything in just the three reusable totes. So I no longer have to use the Target bag, the extra like um, USPS like box and that other purse that I originally had stored a few items in as well. The only thing that didn't really fit, so there are a couple loaves that are kind of just like balancing on top, which I'm fine with. And then the bathing garden also didn't fit, which I'm fine with. I think I might just put those because it's so few. I might just put these um, in my office drawers. I'm sure I can find room for them there. So yeah, that was my loaf collection, organization, declutter video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye, Minnie. Bye, bye Minnie.